everyone this morning. It's Madeline Eames here and I wanted to jump on here on this Monday morning to ask you that question. Do you feel that hidden shame of the potential of making a mistake? Do you feel that fear that rises when you, you worry that you're not going to get it right? Or do you feel that anxiety that someone's going to call you out on something or someone's going to find out that you don't know enough or that you should have done something uh, yesterday? And do you worry that somehow you are, you have the imposter syndrome? Like someone's going to find out that you're not exactly who they thought you were. So just think about that. Do you worry about having some kind of hidden inadequacy or fault? And, and maybe, maybe you don't even know what it is. Hi B. nice to see you today. Thanks for joining me. So I'm talking about whether you have that hidden feeling or that feeling that someone is going to scratch the surface and expose you or that fear that someone will find out um, something that you're not good enough or you've made a mistake. Or do you find that you can have 10 good things said about you and one criticism or constructive feedback and that one thing goes around and around and around in your mind. So can you feel that, that fear or that anxiety that rises around that when we're, when we're out in the world? And does it stop you from going certain places or showing up or meeting with a friend or does it stop you from applying for certain jobs that you really are interested in or from reaching goals that you would love to achieve in your lifetime. So just think for a moment about whether when you're moving around in the world, whether you feel like you have that hidden, that hidden shame that somehow you're going to mis make a mistake. So if this resonates for you, I would let you know that at the root of so many fears we have, the fear of failure, the fear of abandonment, the fear of, um, uh, not fitting in, the, feel, the fear of being left out, is a very core belief of I'm not good enough. So when someone exposes, uh, exposes, <laughs> it feels like exposure. When someone points out something that perhaps you haven't done very well or um, in their eyes, it can really trigger a shame spiral as Brene Brown calls it, or a shame reaction. <clears throat> and that feels very heavy. So the root of a lot of these fears, if not all, is that core belief that you learned at some point that I'm not good enough, which leads us into shame and that um, never ending trap, trap of trying to be perfect. And perfectionism is just another fear. So if this sounds like something that you are struggling with and you wanna reach new heights in your life, whether it's um, your relationships or your work or your um, money, your, your financial abundance, this belief will hold you back. If I have worked through this on my own and I can look back and see it in so many of my clients 
And if you're ready to take that step to really dig out that core belief and hold it to the light and ask yourself, what is good enough? And come to that realization that no matter what, we are all good enough. And that includes you. You are not an exception to this rule. If you're ready to bring it to the light and shine it to the light so that you can feel abundance in all of these areas and freedom, then please message me so that we can have a, a, a chat and see if it's a good time and a good fit for us to work together for you to overcome this fear and experience the freedom that you deserve and the freedom that I also um, have helped my clients to achieve as well. I'll just say hi to Jean. Hi Jean, I'm so glad you're here joining me today on this Monday. So I hope that video has been helpful for you, whether you're watching it now live or in a replay. And if this does resonate with you, I'd love for you to just share below, um, perhaps, you know, how it shows up for you or even share how you have been able to overcome this root core belief. Thanks so much. And I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.